Hello friends, Sam here. So today I will be taking one question. RAML is required for every kind of API. So in MuleSoft, we develop APIs, right? So uh, RAML is buzzword. Everybody talks about RAML, you know. So is it that RAML is required for every kind of APIs? Rather, whenever you create any API in MuleSoft, then that API can be SOAP API. So simple object access protocol, that is one of the packaging protocol. So it can be SOAP API or it can be based on JMS. It can be based on maybe uh, file systems and all. So you are, you are picking up some data from the file server and all. So that can be there. So if you look at the connector which you place in the source part of your flow, you will get an idea that all the APIs are not really REST APIs. So REST means representational state transfer. So all APIs are not REST API. So RAML will be required for all, all kind of APIs in MuleSoft? Definitely not. So if you look at full form of RAML, what is that? REST API Modeling Language. So it is specifically for REST API. So whenever you develop REST API in MuleSoft, at that time you are supposed to use RAML. For what? For API specification. Okay, so in some other video we will talk about API specification and API implementation. So whatever API specification done by API designer for that RAML is getting used. Okay, so I hope this is helpful for you and see you in the next video friends. Thank you. Bye-bye.